And yes, guys, I did cut my hair. I don't know what got into me. Look at this. <laughs> Can somebody tell me, like, how people go to events in such long dresses and they're not, like, falling down? <laughs> oh, guys, Ferragamo is just tempting me. back. I know a lot of you reached out to me and you were like, Romina, where are you? How are you? So it's been a couple tough weeks again and I just couldn't bring myself to, to, to filming YouTube videos. For once we had a loss in the family and I had to deal with some health issues again. It feels like my health issues are just dragging on and on and on. I had appendicitis uh, with some complications. <sighs> if you've been following me, you know that I had to go through a lot of surgeries over the past year and it's left me with some nerve damage as well from all the incisions and it's it's just been it's been tough. I just didn't have the strength or motivation or anything to do YouTube but Guys, I miss it and I really want to go back to my normal schedule. For anybody who has been sick for a while, you probably know that at some point, you know, it's just like you just want to have your normal routine, your everyday routine. And just let me get my coffee. Just drinking my morning coffee and uh, walking around London and filming or sitting at home and filming. That's what I want to do and editing and communicating with all of you. So I, I really want to go back now. We got a lot of stuff to unbox. I, I got a lot of stuff in while. I was sick so we got a new bag we got uh, a couple of designer dresses earrings um, let's do this uh, also I got a porcelain kitty <laughs> I think she goes phenomenally well with this room um, really like her that was love at first sight finally to 2024 hopefully <laughs> Hopefully it's gonna be a good year for all of us. The room is still not entirely done um, but I wanted to show you my artwork oh isn't she gorgeous? And she's pretty tall, you can see it there, the chair and um, the statue and all my little knickknacks, like my peacock, <laughs> still not on the wall. I know I need to get this room done as soon as possible. And yes, guys, I did cut my hair. I don't know what got into me. I think I wanted to try something new. I absolutely don't like it, so I might need to get extensions again. Um, but, you know, you need to try new things to know what you like, what you don't like, right? So this is uh, from Netta Porter as well. This is a gauche 81 dress. Love it. You can wear it just as a um, summer dress, obviously, by itself. Love the cutouts. Um, or... You put a nice little coat on top and you can wear it even in this weather. Yeah, and this is the dress without anything on top of it. I love it. I have not worn high heels in so long and I feel like I don't have any balance anymore. <laughs> okay, so I got a lot of Netta Porta dresses and oh my god, they are all so fantastic and I love how they ship it because you get these... Um, these things <laughs> and they're super helpful obviously if you want to protect your uh, dresses from dust etc so we got this beautiful talamamo dress and I'm just gonna try all of them on quickly and then pair them with my new bag this is a rosario dress and it's so me I love it then we got another uh, dress for special events I mean oh Look at the details it's gorgeous and we got a Giacomo's piece as well I think I need like happy clothes <laughs> for this upcoming year after everything that happened and I don't know this just screamed my name and look at this look at this <laughs> and what I love so much about Netta Porta like the sales are insane like you can find stuff for 50 for 70 percent off and often they also have like extra codes so on the 70 percent off you get like an extra 20 percent off or an extra 10 percent off so always make sure to check out Netta Porta's sales this one oh my god it's my absolute dream dress um it is super long you got like a Yep, you need to be careful. <laughs> and I'm already wearing a super tall high heels. Um, super long, nonetheless. I love this dress. It's so me. This is Costarellas, by the way. I think this one would be ideal for like my next Bulgari event or something like this, you know, where you really want to dress up in like the most fancy way you can, basically. I love the details, the buttons, the lace. Wow. Yeah, this is... Uh... Can't wait to wear this somewhere. Honestly, guys, I'm just like, how would you wear this outside? I think you have to lift the dress up like this. 
to even be able to walk. <laughs> Can somebody tell me like how people go to events in such long dresses and they're not like falling down? <laughs> I mean, it's a beautiful dress. Um, it's just, I think, yeah, I love it. So I will wear it to my next event. <laughs> this Jacquemus blazer dress I've been eyeing for so, so long. And I love it. I love it. Ooh, I'm so happy I got this one now. Honestly, it's probably been longer, more than a year. <laughs> well, I was like debating, should I get a Giacomo's piece? Should I not? Should I? Should I not? Um, so happy I got this from Netta Porter. You can wear this to a super casual event, but still look like more chic than anyone else. <laughs> you know what I mean? Um, if people say, oh, you know, it's just a casual dinner, um, you can look casual but smart and chic and sophisticated. <laughs> this is Rosario and... If I could only wear one outfit for the rest of my life, this would be it. Because <laughs> this is more me than anything else. Like, the velvet up here, it's so beautiful. The lace dress, double layers. Oh, I would say, let's look at my back and um, tell me if you like it. If you remember, like, we visited Ferragamo a while back and I said I'm still getting a little surprise from them, so... Let's unbox that now. And I mean, just look at this. Oh, black lace dress and then a little sparkly bulgari bag. I'm still not really happy with my lighting in here. Still looks quite dark in here, right? That's for another day. So uh, first of all, before we get into the bag, um, I got these Swarovski earrings. You guys know how much I love asymmetric earrings. Okay, I love them. <laughs> So, I love asymmetric dresses. What can I tell you? I love asymmetric jewelry. Oh, let's get into what most people probably came for, um, the bag unboxing. So, um, oh, guys, Ferragamo. It's just tempting me. I've got one, two, three, four Ferragamo bags now. And, okay, let me come closer for this. And then we're gonna go back a bit more. So this is the strap. Does this tell you anything? Actually, I think in this case, it doesn't tell you too much. Oops. So this is the strap and no, it doesn't tell you too much actually about the bag. <laughs> I always love the ASMR <laughs> that comes with a new... I haven't seen it yet, so... Okay, here we are. Ferragamo. You guys know I love the classic Gancini top handle bags. And, um, well, the classic ones, the tall ones. <gasps> and this is going to be my little candy version. It is tiny. It is absolutely tiny. I'll show you the other one uh, in, in, in size comparison in a moment. But this is tiny, but so beautiful. So this is the little candy uh, Gancini top handle Ferragamo bag. And um, yes, it got silver hardware. I love it though. I love it. So I make exceptions for certain silver hardware bags. And this one is one of them. You can open it like this. And they get a little bit uh, more smooth in time the more you open and close it. Got some paper stuff in there. This is the inside. It can hold a little bit, you know. You've got some card slots there. And oh. My husband said uh, this is a little bonbon bag, a little candy bag. And yeah, it does look like a little candy thingy, right? Okay, let me put, uh, let me take this off. Yeah, okay guys, so this is the little candy mini Gancini and she's super cute. But I honestly think it's not too much of a mini bag, so it can hold essentials. We got the strap as well and the attention to detail when it comes to Ferragamo is incredible. Um, you got a really nice strap that comes with it and this mechanism works like you pull this back and there you can see the hook and then you just let it go and that's how it works basically. So I don't know if I'm going to wear this with a strap. You guys know I prefer handheld bags but I always say it if you're running errands or something it's always good to have the option to just throw your bag on your shoulder. What I like doing is I basically take the strap double it up like this and then you can just you know wear it like this it's not too much like 
it's not hanging down or anything. Um, I like to roll it up like this and then just carry the back. Yeah, I love the ombre effect. I obviously got the wonder bag and the ombre effect as well. And uh, let me get it. These are my two Ferragamo ombre effect bags and I loved it when they came out with this style. I don't know why I love ombre effects, so. This is the classic top handle. Gancini and this is the wonder bag. I don't know if you remember I got this Fendi bag charm a couple years ago and um, I never really know which bag to attach it to because I don't know it just didn't work but I feel like this candy bag and this Fendi bag charm monster is a match made in heaven and this has gold hardware actually then I can mix uh, silver and gold that's quite cool so I thought maybe this is its final home finally if I can get it on. So here we are with my Fendi <laughs> back charm and I don't know it's cute right? Maybe this is it. Maybe this is how I'm gonna wear this bag. So yeah guys this is it. Uh, new year, new wardrobe, new bag. Um, I love it. I think it's cute even though it got silver hardware um, and most of my bags um, got gold hardware. Yeah, so if you enjoyed today's video, please give it a thumbs up. Let me know which outfit was your favorite one. Tell me in the comment section below. And I hope everyone is doing fine, guys. And yeah, give this video a thumbs up, subscribe. Join our little handbag obsessed family here because we all got the same luxury disease. Yes, <laughs> that we can see it. And yeah, guys, I see you again very soon, hopefully. Hopefully I'm gonna go back to my regular uploading schedule now. Um, I'm going to try my best. Bye. Oh yeah guys, and I forgot to show you the size comparison. I'm already in my flouchy again. <laughs> so my onesie, uh, don't mind that. Um, so these are the regular sized Gancini top handle bags. Let me put it here. There you can see it. And this is the tiny little candy size. Um, so obviously you fit a lot more into these bags. Here we've got the black one. But this can still hold a little bit.